Hello and welcome to Profiles in Risk. This is your host, Tony Canyas, and today I have with me Brendan Kaur, who leads sales for the Loss Run Pros, which I have a hard, very hard time saying. Brendan, thank you for joining me today. How's it going? Very good, Tony. Thanks so much for having me on. I very much appreciate it today. My, my pleasure, my pleasure. So we always give the guests the chance of, of, of giving the elevator pitch. So, so, so what is uh, Lost Runs Pro, Pros? Absolutely, man. Yeah. Uh, Lost Run Pro, LRP, you know, kind of anything in between. Uh, we're a two-year-old startup out of Missoula, Montana. Um, my my uh, founder, Regan Branch, she kind of came up with the idea after she found herself on the losing end of some... Uh, she owns a premium finance company, but really kind of found out through some research, like what is the problem with loss runs and found out that there's really no simplified solution for retail agents. Customers are having to go to their old incumbent broker. They're having to call the carriers by themselves to request loss runs. And the more she found, the more she was just like, how is it 2019 at the time? And this isn't a solvable, pro like, where are we? And so anyway, she set out back in September of 2019 to truly solve the problem. And now today we have a product on the, at the market that solves both loss runs for new business and also streamlines some of the renewal requests that an agency might be making as well. Okay. So, so I, I've never worked on an agency, but I, I've served agencies in, in, in different ways. And yeah, it, it, uh, loss runs is one of those things that everybody, everybody complains about and right. it, it's a it's a really weird i mean it, it i guess it, it it becomes second nature for for us what once you've been in the industry for a while but but it is it is a really weird uh part of of what we do if you, if you think about it in order to to for 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 you as, as an agent uh in, in order for for for, for you to properly get a quote for for a new client yeah you basically have to let their existing uh yeah uh, broker know broker right no oh, which totally, is man uh, you know warns them that that, that they, they like, exactly that the, this account is getting, is getting shopped uh and uh the process generally with the carriers is not super efficient and 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 also uh, as a former underwriter, the the the, uh, the loss runs, depending on the carrier, come in a whole bunch of different formats. Like like like, like it, there, there's no standardization. So so uh, so yeah, it's 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 a painful process through through and through. So so how how do you guys make it work? So 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 if if I if I'm a, an independent agent, and 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 I have a new a new client that that that. Uh, it's coming to me from a different agency. How do you guys help? Yeah, I mean, even going back one step further, it's like, man, like how, like, it's such a small piece of the business too, right? Loss runs, it's like one tiny piece of the insurance process. But yet if, you, if an agent doesn't have the loss runs, they can't get a seat at the table to go quote the business. And then it becomes income or uh, the onus is on, the customer, the prospect to go and get them from their incumbent broker. Like, as you were saying, so it tips them off and it's like, how is that the process here? So what we do is we, our solution for that new business that we're discussing, an agent can sign up online. It's a super simple, it's $29 a month, 300 bucks for the year, super easy. We wanted this to be a process that was easy enough because it isn't a very complex process. Um, but what they can do is the system is designed to be able to track in real time. So they can log in, create the letter, track it throughout its process. They can email it directly to the insured. The insured can then e-sign it directly within the portal. So again, simplifying it not only from an agency standpoint, but also from the customer level. But then once it's signed, it goes directly to the carriers. So it truly is bypassing not only the incumbent broker, but simplifying it from a customer level and then really making it easy on the agency or the agent who's ever writing or looking to prospect. So it definitely has really, I, I want to say, simplified it, automated that process. 
because anybody, you know, anybody who's writing commercial business uh, can come and sign up. But truly, once they're in the system, everything is automated. And these are all processes that most independent agents are familiar with if they're ever writing any commercial business. So it's just helping to automate an already very clunky process that they're probably used to. Okay. So, so 29 bucks a month, is that uh, unlimited use? Uh, it is a per user subscription. So per and, and user. Per so head. Yes. So, so per head. Okay, perfect. So, so, so uh, if, I, if I've got, you know, five producers in my, in my agency, so, 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 so five licenses, and yep. and then they can each use it as much as much as, exactly. uh, as as they want to go. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So so on 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 the back end, uh, does it does it connect does it connect to the carrier APIs to get those lo the loss runs or or how do, how do, how does it get the lo loss runs do, and does it work with 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 every carrier or is there a subset of carriers for now that are part of the system? No, we don't have any direct APIs. I mean, that's certainly a part of the process that we're eventually getting to. But our first, I mean, you know, that's probably, a, you know, ideally, and we're having some of these conversations with these carriers uh, to get into that process. But what we found is when we were knocking on the doors, they said, hey, loss runs are a problem. And it's just as clunky for carriers. Like they have a whole claims department and they're, you know, they're getting thousands of requests a day. But they basically said, hey, we love the idea of what you guys are doing go get 10,000 users, prove the model works. And so it's kind of a chicken or the egg here, right? So we said, no problem, they love our idea, now let's take it to market. Now, what is happening is, so when a request is processed through the site, it's sent directly to the customer. So then the customer gets it, they sign it, and then when they sign it, it actually is being sent then from their company name to the carrier. So that way the carrier not only is receiving it from the authorized signer, right? Authorizing the release of their loss run history or loss run data, but then it's also appearing in the inbox of carriers and it's saying, hey, it's coming from golf events. It's coming from Tim's trucks. You know, so that way it's hitting their inbox within all of the boxes that the carriers need to check in order to release it and, you know, kind of hit all their boxes that they're looking for. Okay. Hopefully uh, that helps. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I find I find it uh, very interesting where the solution came from. the 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 fact that that uh, that your founder runs a premium uh, a premium finance company, uh, yep. right? So 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 by by not being uh, one of the two main parties to 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 this messy process, uh, she had visibility to it. Uh, but totally. but wasn't what uh, what wasn't married to 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 an existing process. Uh, well, it was it was I mean yeah like so through financing she was losing business all the way downstream because agents couldn't get loss runs at, before you know at binding and she's like how am I being affected like why if they want their information how are they unable to get it and why and so when she actually looked at it. And I think that's also what allowed us to really solve the actual problem. She looked at it with a clean pair of eyes and said, hey, what is going on here? And really learned the problem and then took it. And we won some early seed money from, from BTV, the Broker Tech Ventures Group. And she uh, pitched this idea and they were all like, love it. Like, we can't wait, like, absolutely. And so we were able to then really produce the the platform that we have today that we've released, which, you know, has truly been vetted by some of the top PNC companies in, in, you know, in the nation, but also because we started from scratch with a clean slate and then identified the solution from there. You know, we, she didn't have a retail background as an agent came again, Columbia Pacific finance and just found herself on the losing end and wanted to solve it. Gotcha. 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 Uh, so, so uh, I'm just curious: are 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 there other Montana insurtechs? You know, there you know there are. You know, it's, it's certainly not Montana. Isn't usually the insurtech capital that people think of, but you know, it 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 is like I mean, Missoula, Billings. You know, there certainly is more tech that is coming to 
to the Montana state, you know, I'm actually a Seattle kid. I actually just moved to Montana to help kind of build this company. So I'm still getting used to it. I've got my first fly fishing lesson next weekend. You know, I'm going out, I'm really diving into the Montana lifestyle. I was like, I got to get a pair of cowboy boots. I got to learn to fly fish. You know, I got to really do it. <laughs> I, I, I got to say, g- giving up Seattle uh, to go to Montana, it, it does show a ton of commitment and belief in, right. in, 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 in the company, right? Uh, in, in, in my day job, I, I, uh, I do recruiting for, for insurance companies and, and now for insure techs. Uh, yeah. And, and if, if, if your founder had called me and said, hey, I, I need a head, head of sales, I want them to, to move to Montana, the first thing I would have told, I would have told her is... Good luck. <laughs> how about remote, right? Like, very, very yeah. little chance we could convince somebody to move to Montana. Uh, yeah. So, so, and she, so, I mean, now to be fair, she, she did say that, you know, and she was like, look, this can be a remote position, but then I got here and man, I've been a Seattle kid my whole life. And it's like, we got mountains 10 minutes from the doorstep. We got a river running right through. I'm like, I can give it a chance over here. Let's, you know, let me learn how to fly fish. And, you know, I mean, it's just uh, hiking, camping, it's, it, you know, the outdoors is just, it's, it's lovely, you know? So, so yes, I, I, yes. I, I have uh, visited. Uh, I, I, it, it's funny. So, so the few states that I have not seen are very nearby. Like I haven't seen Idaho and the, 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 the Wyoming kind of thing. Right. Uh, but, but, uh, but Montana, I, I, a, a friend years ago uh, won a trip to, to, to the Marlboro Ranch uh, and, and uh, took me with her and, <laughs> So, so got, got to, to hang out in Bozy Man for, for a yeah. long weekend or like, like four days. It was, it was a lot of fun. Beautiful, definitely just a gorgeous, gorgeous area. It is. Uh, it is. If, if any other Montana insurtechs listen to this podcast because of, of you guys, reach yep. out. Would love to, ha- to, to have you on. Totally. Uh, Jump on represent. the podcast. Yeah, like absolutely. Yourself. Love it. Awesome. So, so very, very interesting uh, st- stuff to learn, to learn, to learn about. So, so uh if uh, uh the listeners are, are you know interested in taking a look at, at how it works uh what's yeah. what's the easiest way to connect uh, lost run pro.com yep. or yep. reach out directly or like is yeah there- they can yeah you can go online i mean they, you know the nice part is is it is a subscription service you know so lost run pro.com you can then sign up directly on the website again monthly yearly subscription options uh, you can book a demo through the website. So that way you can uh, grab a spot with uh, one of our team members and, and, or you can just reach out B core, B C O R R at lossrunpro.com. Email into me, you know, you can carry your pigeons, you know, that works too. You can let us know how you want. If you, if you're interested, um, you know, most people haven't heard of lost run pro. It's not a huge, you know, we're not, we don't have a lot of competitors. We do have one in the marketplace. It's, you know, it's not a very saturated place. So, but, you know, it is a problem that most retail agents have faced and or are facing. And so we are, I mean, just to give you a little background, you know, we started last year with 88 pilot accounts. We have over 1200 active users already, you know, so in just over a year, we've grown substantially, you know, it's a proven model. It is working and, you know, our goal is to continue to build and take this thing to the carriers, you know, to truly integrate and make this a, a pretty seamless tool that agencies and carriers can benefit from. And, and uh, having gone to, through, through broker tech uh, mm-hmm. speaks well of, of, you, of you guys. I, I love broker tech, not only Iowa pride, but, but uh, uh, <laughs> I, 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 I love broker tech be, be, because of uh it's it's backed by brokers, the, 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 like so right. so they're investing in the companies that that they think will make a difference for them, right? So uh, certainly, it's not a yeah. I mean, hammer you know, and even a problem to fix. Well, and you know, and I think what even speaks more volumes is like for 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 us specifically is it certainly it gave a, it gave Regan, you know, when she took this to them. It allowed her to ask the right questions to then solve, right? That gave us the solution because she's talking to real producers, real brokers, real people who have the problem. And then what happened was they all signed up and they said, hey, we're in, we're, we'll, we'll help you guys build it, you know, market it, you know, legal, you know, 
they gave us all the the head the headspace. But then now they're all turning around and they're saying, "Hey, we're in beyond just the pilot. You know, we'll pay for our seats." Like that's the best part. That shows that the solution. You know, Holmes Murphy, IMA, the Partners Group. You know, all these guys. You know, Connor Strong. They're all investing beyond just being a part of BTV now. They're all investing in Lost Run Pro and actively using it. You know. So it's really, it's really fun to see. And also just great exposure and experience for us because we're, tra- we're talking to the people on the front lines daily with these guys. Fantastic. Uh, uh, very interesting. Uh, thank you for your time, Brendan. And, and, and when, when it goes live, I'll tag you and the company and in- include the link to, to, to the company website. Uh, and look forward to see how you guys continue to, to, to innovate. And in, uh, it, it's, a, it's a great example of, of, of how uh you don't have to revolutionize all, all of insurance to be successful in, in, in our space like choose one process that's <laughs> beyond belief broken uh i mean that's and, and also like you know again i, I like I, i love the idea that she didn't even come she wasn't an age you know like there was a problem that she identified and then just it was you know we don't we're not an ams system we don't solve everything we just do one thing and it's relatively cheap in comparison to a lot of other tools But yeah, it's fantastic. And I appreciate you having me on. Who do you got for to win it all? Who do you got in your final four? Who's who's winning it? Are you a bracket guy? <laughs> I am not. I I, I our not. work one was due today at noon. Uh last year I, I, I chose randomly and did not do well. Uh this year I I did not <laughs> I, yeah, yeah. I didn't fill it out this year. So yeah, uh, I'm 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 an Iowa State grad twice. Uh okay. I think that yeah. that that I've noticed we've been in the tournament a couple of times in the 15 years yeah. that, that since, since I, since I graduated. Uh, so, so uh, yeah, just not a, not a big, well, uh, it looks, guy. it looks like your competitors, Iowa, they're down one at halftime to Richmond right now, 29, 28. So you can root, you can root for Richmond. <laughs> they're playing <laughs> Iowa. Co- 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 correct. Uh, it's, it's uh It's one of those things that they have a much better sports program than the majority of years. Uh, it it yeah. when I when I meet Iowa grads out 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 and I haven't lived in Iowa for 10 years, but when when I when I run into Iowa grads, what I, what I tell them is it is uh, it'd be nice if there was an actual university attached to the great sports program. <laughs> I love the interstate rivalries, man. It's so good. It's so great. Yeah. Well, certainly appreciate your time, Tony. Thanks for having Thank me on. You. Thanks for giving me a platform to, to talk about Lost Run Pro. My pleasure. Very much Have appreciate a good it. one. All right, cheers.